Okay, a couple updates. Um, here's the compost pile. It's about day 20 or so. So just to recap, uh, it's about 300 pounds of coffee grounds, 300 pounds of wood chips. I'd say it's about three and a half feet high. Um, you'll, you'll pile it up together in kind of a lasagna. So you do wood chips, coffee grounds, wood chips, coffee grounds, wood chips, coffee grounds. Uh, you'll, you'll have it damp. They always say to, if you grab a handful and squeeze it, you get a couple drops out of that squeeze. Um, and so you'll put it together. You'll turn it the fourth day after that. And then every two days after that until it looks like compost, I guess. Um, it's called like the Ber Berkeley method. Um, and you'll turn it starting from the outside. You'll pile that up and then go all the way around, pile it up, you know, do a couple inches at a time from the outside in. Uh, it's kind of hard to see how fine it is from here, but it's definitely, you know, getting black and a lot finer. And it smells like earth. It doesn't smell like coffee grounds anymore. Um, let me see if I can get... If it's still warm or not. Uh, not really warm right there. So, it might be uh, pretty much done. And I think that was a good amount of... Uh, good amount of coffee grounds. I mean, maybe it could always use more. I think the, the coffee grounds are the nitrogen, so it might have heated up more. Um, if you use more coffee grounds. <clears throat> Here's the uh, second pile that I've started. Um, just piling up coffee grounds. I'll get these from Starbucks. There's a bag full of tea. Um, basically just pile it up. They have uh, two different types of coffee grounds. They have these espresso ones that are I guess like this circle. <clears throat> And those are really dry. Um, and then they just have, you know, regular grounds in a filter that's uh, pretty wet and everything. So both work pretty good. Uh, here's another one. I think these circle ones, they just fly all over the place. But just pile it up, and once you get a big enough pile, you can start turning it and whatnot. Uh, I was going to do one other video of the worms. So here's the worm bin. Uh, if you can see, there's a bunch of worms in there. And so basically 90% of this is coffee grounds. It looks like a disc of coffee grounds. Um, the filters, the bags. I put some green in there just to kind of diversify it. Uh, some scraps. I was going to put some... Uh, Corn tortillas in there. It seems like I'll try and moisten things because it seems like it kind of dries out. Um, oops. But uh, any new food, I'll just cover up. And uh, everything seems to be working pretty good. Uh, city of Burien, Normandy Park is having a, uh, like a worm bin sale or something. So you can buy an actual worm bin for like 20 bucks in May. So I'll probably end up doing that and set that up. Um, but this is kind of the weekend update. So subscribe and then, uh, you can see what else is going on around here.